Raising a family here in Austin back in those days was, was hard. When we tried to speak Spanish in class, they would discipline us and take us to the restroom and uh, wash our mouth out with soap. The only Mexicano CPA in Austin was me. And people, even Mexican-American businesses, did not want to give me the business. I started realizing more about uh, discrimination. I started noticing uh, directly at us. The Chicano movement was instrumental in getting several waves of generations aware of the fact that we had a separate culture. To give us a sense of direction, to give us a sense of aquí está nuestra cultura y no nos vamos. Well, I think it opened my eyes to be able to kind of look at, at events and say, what's happening here? What, what is really going on here? But there was a lot of energy, and there was a lot of togetherness in trying to work for that effort. All the participation with the farm workers, Cesar Chavez, the economy furniture strike, led me into the field of public service. It was just a lot of energy for pride. And I think that's what moved us most, the pride that you have in yourself and your community and your culture. It's a whole new world. It's like opening up a book and, and, and having stars and, and all these beautiful things come out and you say, wow. Only by knowing the individual contributions can we really, you know, tell the whole story.